Hey guys, get ready with me for school. Don't mind the sweat spot on my shirt. I was trying to get like a spot out. Um, so yesterday I curled my hair. That went everywhere. Or I straightened my hair. So I don't have to do it today. Um, I woke up at three in the morning today thinking that my alarm didn't go off or something. So you know you get that feeling when you're like, okay, like I've had enough sleep. That's what I had. And then I looked at the clock and it was three. And then I just could not go back to sleep. And so once this primer runs out, I'm gonna get the milk makeup primer. Because I heard that it's water water based and it won't make my makeup like crack or whatever it does. I was researching it because it's water based. I don't know if I already said that. I'm so hungry since like I woke up at three. I was literally just laying in my bed. I turned my fan back on because I have this like noise up and it turned off. And I turned that back on and I tried to go back to sleep. I did not go to back to sleep. And I just had so much on my mind. Like I really could not sleep. I don't know how like the outside of that gets so messy because I just like put it straight in. I don't know. I'm gonna clean it one of these days so it looks better. Cause I can't stand when my makeup is messy. This okay wait I was gonna say this will not roll up. Um I'm actually so hungry right now. I don't think you understand. Today after school we have well not right after school but after school I have volleyball pictures. So I'll just touch up my makeup. I'll probably make it another get ready with me. And yeah. So I'll be fun, I guess. Okay, so I don't have um concealer on, obviously. But I'm just gonna go over with powder. I'm just gonna brush my eyebrows because I ran out of my spoolies. And I think I have some for Christmas, but I can't have them until Christmas. I grabbed my eyelash curler from my dad's house since my other one is like, I don't know what happened to it. I'm going to do my mascara and then I'll be back. Okay, lashes are done. This freaking wet spot is still not dry and I'm very concerned. I think it got smaller, but still. Okay, I'm going to set my makeup. And we're going to use 40. I meant to spray my neck and I like completely missed. Okay. I'll do an OOTD. Nike. Nike, Kendra, Target, Target, Pure Vita, Pure Vita. <gasps> um, that's it. Hi guys. If he had been with me is the saddest book I have read in my entire life. Literally, why? That's just, it's so sad. Literally, it's my new Roman Empire. Like, I haven't been able to stop thinking about it. The one from Finn's point of view is coming out in like three days, I think, and I'm so excited to get it. I'm literally not ready for it at all. Speaking of things I'm not ready for, I'm not ready for convention. I freaking hate dance conventions so much. Like, the classes literally make me feel like I'm the worst dancer there. I just, like, my confidence goes so low whenever I go to convention. And I've only been to one. Going to two this season, one for our first competition and then one for our nationals. I changed the lighting. This is the one I usually use. The other one made me look kind of pale. This was the slowest week at school I've had in a long time. I was just ready to get out of there. We're gonna go to the store to get some groceries. I went to bed like at around 1.30. I just did not want to go to sleep. And I was watching um, while you were sleeping. The movie's kind of weird. I don't know. I don't like it that much, to be honest. I don't like the ending of it, to be honest. Like, obviously that was gonna happen, but like, I don't like it. I need book recommendations. If he had been with me, literally got me out of my ring slump that I've been in for like a year and a half, to be honest. I'm not gonna lie. I didn't bring a, a single book over the summer. Actually, I did read a book, but I didn't, like, actually finish it. 
and I've read The Summer Time Pretty on repeat. So that doesn't really count because I've read it so many times. The book that put me in the reading slump was New Moon, the second book in the Twilight series. Really, I stopped reading for like a year after that, to be honest. I like books like If He Had Been With Me, um, Better Than the Movies, The Summer Time Pretty. Too. I like those kind of books, so anything like that. Or even like horror or like books like books that have like no body no crime vibes <laughs> i don't even need to put on this much makeup we're literally just going to the store <laughs> last night it felt like the longest night of my life like literally it felt like never ending i don't know why but last night was actually a pretty good night also i woke up today and i feel like i grew like three inches like i think i'm like five four now and that's actually pretty good i want to be like five five like that's the max high i want to be to be honest i, I want to be tall but not like that tall i'm already taller than a lot of guys in my grade i'm only five two um, so, yeah. But, you know, whatever. Um, a couple of guys are actually taller than me now. Or they're getting taller. Or they're my height now, I guess. And I'm not really that much taller than you guys now. My little sister just runs in here and she said, I need a shirt. Grabs a shirt from my floor that I was trying on earlier and says, bye. Literally eight. I don't know why she thinks it's gonna fit her. She just came in here and said, is it dirty? No. I should've just said yes, so she gave it back to me. But I think I'm gonna set today. So close to 1k and I'm so excited because what the heck. At least started this year off. I think I had like 400. I'm gonna use 68 because I haven't used it in so long. Okay guys, that's it. Bye. It's about 9.15 in the morning right now and I'm getting ready for Pilates. I've already done my skincare and my hair and I put on all my jewelry so now I need to pick out my outfit. So you guys are going to pick out an outfit with me and then come with me to Pilates today. I want to vlog as much as I can because I know you guys have a lot of questions about Pilates. But first, let's get dressed. Outfit is on. I decided to put on these Lulu leggings because they're so comfy when working out. But now I'm going to put on my little Pilates socks. Here is my outfit for today. It'll be linked in my like to know it. I'm going to study after Pilates, so I'm going to go ahead and bring my school bag. Finals week is this week, so I really need to take school seriously. We are running right on time. It just takes a while to get to my car. I am not gonna miss this walk whenever I have an apartment. I'm also not gonna miss these stairs. Let's go ahead and go to Pilates. I just pulled up to my Pilates studio. You're supposed to get here like 15 minutes early so you can set up your reformer to how you want it. And so you can get your weights and everything before class. My class starts at 10. I'm taking Pilates Sculpt today. It's basically just a full body workout on the reformer and I love it so much. So let's go ahead and go inside. As y'all can see, I just got out of my Pilates class. I'm not gonna lie, that was killer today. I am so tired and already so sore, but that was so fun to go together. I hope you guys got some of your questions answered. Now I have to go study for finals, sadly, so I'm gonna say goodbye to you guys. And I need to touch up myself because I look a little bit rough. Happy Sunday, you guys, and I'll see y'all later. Bye, guys. Rise and shine. Good morning, guys. Get ready with me. Take the screen protector off my phone on Monday, and now I'm really scared that it's gonna like fall over and I'm gonna break the screen. But it's fine. I literally always forget to put music on when I'm doing a get ready with me. Like, that's literally the whole point. Well, not the whole point. The whole point is to get ready, but you get what I mean. Yeah. Currently, quarter past nine on a Wednesday morning. Um, a very gloomy Wednesday morning, I must say, to leave for the station in like an hour. So I'm gonna try and do my get ready with me in like half an hour because my room is such a mess and Livy's staying around mine later. So I wanna tidy it before. We get back. But look at these little stickers I put on my glow recipe thing. They're so cute. So annoyed because I tried to do all of my psychology work yesterday. It's due tomorrow morning. Um, I have had two weeks to do it and I realized you have to go and pick something up from college to do the work and I haven't picked it up. So today I'm gonna have to actually go and pick it up. It's gonna be so embarrassing. So can, like, isn't this due tomorrow? But like, yes. Ooh. So Loki don't feel well today. I think it's because I'm on my period. I always mention that I might get ready me's and I don't know why, but it's fine. Literally have no clue what I should do for makeup. Like, should I put skin tint on or should I just put concealer? I might just do concealer. I'm having a bit of a hair dilemma though because I actually woke up at 8 o'clock. I don't have to leave for the train until 10, but I woke up at 8. Don't know why I did that. So my hair is really greasy. So I was like, it's fine. I'll just wash my hair in the morning. Woke up. I was like, no, I don't want to do it. So I'm just going to have to slick it back again. Wait, let me go and wet this. 
Oh my god, that's just separated on my chin. That's not okay. Oh, guess what I'm doing tomorrow. You're actually going to be so proud. I am driving to college. If you're new here, you may be like, why is that deep? But before half time, um, I drove to college. I couldn't find anywhere to park. So I just drove home. Like, I've had such a bad experience with parking. I'm just going to breathe it tomorrow and actually find somewhere to park because this cannot go on. I'm actually going to cry if my headaches don't start getting better because I'm getting them like every single day. Like, literally stop. Like, it's really annoying me. Okay, right. Quick, 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 quick. I already got dressed because I saw picked out an outfit in my head before I went to sleep last night. Oh, I just wanted to be summer so bad. I was looking back at all my summer pictures yesterday. It's like the 100th time this year. Uh, that's kind of like a new thing because I never really used to do that. I don't know why, but I am doing it this year and it's making me really, really sad. Guys, I've got an update on the creep vlog for you after literally like six months. I think I'm going to upload it in two weeks time. I don't know why it's taking me so long because it's literally already edited. I just need to like make final edits and like do like an intro and stuff like that. Is it's nearly seven months after I filmed it? Yeah, but better late than never. So long though, like, I don't even know if people are going to want to watch it. Like it's like 45 minutes long. Okay, bronzer time. Oh, I really want to get my nails done. I was looking at nails last night. Look how disgusting my nails are. Like it's actually a joke. I really want to get navy nails again, but I don't know if you remember last time I got navy nails. They were the, like, I hated them so much and i tried to gaslight myself into thinking they were really cute but i like didn't like them so i don't really know what to do because i was thinking of getting them done friday after my geography lesson but i like don't think i just rose my daffodils are literally dead they're like actually completely dead oops anyway as i was saying i was gonna get them done after geography but i don't think i'm gonna have enough time going out friday evening but then maybe that's another reason i should get them a little bit of a dilemma going on here I might just do a French plat. I haven't done one French plat in ages. Well, my headache is literally getting worse. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do about coats because it is raining outside, so maybe I should bring a coat. But I actually really like not wearing a coat on Monday. Why do my lashes look so short today? I feel like I'm getting lash dysmorphia. Lashes actually aren't as short as they used to be, but I feel like they're getting shorter. I don't know why. It's not a good lash day. Like, I'm very much giving spider lash. Like, I can count how many eyelashes are on this eye. Okay, I'm just gonna have to let it work because there's no other option. I should have just washed my hair. I'm actually so lazy. Okay, perfume. I also went with this combination on Monday, but it works. I'm gonna have to buy a new one of this soon. I'm running out, especially for summer. I kind of want to get the light pink one though. Oh, setting spray. Mm, this one smells so good. Okay, here's a fit check. Jeans are from White Fox, jumpers from Brandy, and this little vest top is from Zara. I love these vest tops. I have one nude as well. They're like a really like slinky material, and I really like them. If I wear a coat, I'm going to wear my Ralph Lauren one. I actually haven't worn this in ages, and I'm going to wear it with my blue and white Adidas Giselles because that's going to match perfectly with the blue and the white. So, yeah, fit check secured. On that note, thank you guys for getting ready with me. I actually have 20 minutes before I need to leave for the train, so I'm just going to quickly tidy up my room and and yeah, hey guys, bye. Please come on, what happened in the Snapchat group chat? So basically, I have this group chat on Snapchat. I told all of my supporters that wanted to add me on Snap and join the group chat. I told them to do it. I said, add my Snap and I'll add you to the group chat, period. I made the group chat. We're all laughing, having fun. We were doing face reveals and everything. And then they started arguing over a rumor about somebody being someone like this random girl was like oh someone said that this girl was 15 and she's really not 15 and that's what she told everybody she said no that's not true i'm not 15 and then we could have just left it at that but then the girl's like oh don't catch no attitude because you'll get clocked real quick first of all you're not clocking anyone the only thing that's getting clocked is you so then everybody kind of gets on her and they're like, um, girl, it's not that deep. Basically, everyone's saying how it's not that serious. And then the girl's like, first of all, all y'all need to shut up because no one's talking to you. Huh? That's when I spring into action. And sorry if I'm talking low, it's just, it's late. I spring into action and I'm like, girl, first of all, you need to shut up and everybody needs to stop arguing. Then she's like, no, you need to shut up. First of all, what? What did you expect? What did you think that was going to happen after that? Because this is a supporter group chat. And you're a supporter. You added me, right? So then everyone gets on her because why are you telling me to hush? She was like, oh no. No, I'm not going to hush. You need to hush. What? Then everybody starts getting on her case because why are you treating the owner like that? You know what I'm saying? So then everybody getting on her, start cussing her out. Then she starts cussing back. Then she adds her two little besties that 
were just as annoying as her like i'm telling you like they would not stop talking mind you this was going on for about four hours so then i'm, I'm like clocking her right here right here in her temple and i'm like girl let me shut up because you know i'm not gonna say what i said but just know i said something and then i'm like i'm getting tired of this this is going on for way too long it's been four hours so then she sends her face and everyone starts getting on her they're screenshotting her forehead because it gave very much dirty dry and ashy so then i get on live because i'm bored of doing that and then i call up my friend jordan yes my bestie and i was like jordan go clock her for me i'm gonna add you to the group chat and he's like okay bet bet and then i also tell my friend davy i'm like girl clock her as well because i'm trying to focus on my live and i'm not trying to keep going back and forth with that girl all night so then she's like bad and then they start clocking like gagging but yeah y'all come back for part two bye y'all let me tell y'all how my saturday night went because like my friend was hosting a kickback so obviously i'm gonna go so i'm getting ready and then my boyfriend called Anyways, my boyfriend calls me and he's like, guess who's going? And then he said, the guy that I talked to literally before him is going. We're going to call him Luke. And I was like, what? Like, literally what? But then he was like, no, I'm just kidding. But like, imagine if he did go. So fast forward, I get picked up by my friend to go to the kickback. And they're talking about Luke. And they are friends with him, but he does live far. So I was like, oh yeah, do y'all remember whenever like me and him used to have a thing? Then they go, yeah, he's coming. So I was like, oh my fuck, why is this happening to me? Fast forward to the kickback. So keep in mind that my boyfriend and Luke used to be good friends. I just dropped something. They're still cool with each other, but they're just not friends like that anymore. So I guess like he was on Ox and then I had said something about the song or like his music taste. And I shit you not, his response was like, says the one that used to always listen to my entire playlist. Oh, I literally almost cried, how dare he say Anyway, so a bunch of other stuff happened. But I actually refused to go into detail about that, literally for my own well-being. And I asked my friends like what they thought about everything, and they were just saying that mine and Luke's past kind of like kept on getting brought up. And I do kind of agree, like it was pretty awkward too. Anyways, thank y'all so much for 5k, and thank y'all for almost 1k on Insta. And I've been trying to follow literally everyone that follows me because like y'all are so cute and get DMs from y'all and they're so sweet. Anyways, bye guys. Get ready for me story time. I thought I could talk to trees and control the wind. Where I live, it is really like rainy and always like windy all the time. And before, I used to play outside a lot. One day, the weather was like so windy. So I went to go play outside and the wind was so heavy and the trees were like so fast. And I said, trees, it's okay. I'm here. Calm down. Okay, trees. Okay, trees. And then I was like, stop the wind. And I could tell you for a fact, I am not making this up. And it was a huge error for me. My wind talking era. I also thought if I touched a walnut tree, it would give me all the wishes I wanted. Anyways, love you guys. Bye.